it's going to absorb right in again. And some more sand over the top. You do one more. All right. Let me set that right there for now. So over time now, <coughs> sand, since it's so hot, I'm just going to throw some sand over here. We're going to leave it for a bit. Let that all bake inside there. So when, now it's just baking the sandstone so it's going to harden right now. So it's just doing it out here. So out here when I was a little kid, instead of snowball fights, we used to have mud ball fights. <laughs> so now over time, thousands of years, the sandstone has been blowing around and gives us this little formation right here. So this right here, pick this up, dump it off. It's actually pretty hard. Wow. You guys want to feel that? Oh wow, look at that. <laughs> Oops, sorry. Sorry. Use too much force. Wow. So over time now, we've had fractures, cans, fractures, cracks, and water coming through our wash, flowing through the canyon, gave us our canyon. So I'm going to crack this just a tad bit. That wasn't supposed to happen like that. But over time, water just flowing through here carved out our canyon over thousands of years. So this canyon is estimated to be in the 250 to 300,000 year old range. So you get like the Grand Canyon, the Escalante Cliffs, and the Vermilion Cliffs. Those are all in the million range. And we're not there yet. So, there's water with But I'm going to pull this apart. So there is so much water going through a little, small, tight little area. So the water whirlpools all the time. So we break this apart now. So just like how the canyon is, you kind of see the texture in that. You see that? Yeah, you got Swirls. It. So we made a little canyon. <laughs> <laughs> and then we should break it. 